Hey YouTube, what's up? Um, I've got another case review for you. Um, this case is a bit of a different sort of case in the design style of it. Um, this one is designed to make your iPhone look like a tape or cassette or whatever you like to call them. Um, so yeah, let's open it up and have a look at it. Alright, so on the side there we've got the rather enlarged versions of the volume button controls. Um, on the top, again, an enlarged, enlarged version of the lock button. Um, enough room for the headphones and the mic on the top. Um, nothing on that side, of course. Um, on the bottom, enough room for the speakers but there's not enough room for the cable which is pretty obvious as you can see <laughs> um, on the back uh, it's really nice styled uh, this part here um, I don't know if it's paper or if it's just the actual plastic but it feels like you can actually you know where it's got the lines it feels like you can write on them B, um, got uh, yes, no, um, and obviously where you put the names, or when it when they were tight tapes, you'd put the name of the track on there. Um, on the bottom of the back, uh, there is um, I don't know if you can see. Uh, let's try and figure out way. Yeah, there we go. You can sort of see it's a bit enlarged there like raised a bit at the back so it's sort of sloped um, which again is a nice feature um, so yeah I'll put it on my iPhone now and show you guys alright putting it on really simple it's made out of silicon so it's really easy to put on just snaps on there we go yeah there we go uh, right so on the top the lock button you have to really, there's one problem there, you have to really push the lock button. Well, not really push, but you know, you have to sort of find the area. There it is. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so that's more for your thumb or second finger there. Yeah, I can get used to that. Uh, there we go, we've got enough room for the, I can't remember what you call it, mute. <laughs> no sound, silent. <laughs> the button anyway. <laughs> uh, volume controls. I'll just get that. Yeah, there's enough room for the volume controls there. The buttons feel really great, really nice in your hand. Uh, there we go. Um, bottom again, they're just uh, cut out space for the speakers and the mic, as you can see there. Uh, it feels really nice. It's just like I don't know. Oh yeah, in the back, I forgot about this bit. Um, it's supposed to be cut out for the to show the Apple there, but obviously it's just a little bit off. And again for the iPhone at the bottom, and then it's cut out there for the other part. Uh, right. Oh yeah, and the camera. <laughs> Forgot about the camera. Um, yeah, so uh, I don't know if you can see that as well. They've the silicone sort of made to look like a screw as well. There, there we go. Yeah, there. Um, so yeah, feels great in your hand as well. Really nice. You can tell this one's been like well designed and everything. Uh, so yeah, using your iPhone, really easy really simple with this case on apart from the lock button which you just have to get used to um, if you're using this case it's not a problem on the case it's just you know you've got to find the spot first and then you start getting used to using that spot uh, but apart from that this case feels great um, this is going to be involved in my first giveaway of this channel uh, which will be this week and just to let you all know there will be a giveaway every week on my channel now, on this new channel anyway. Um, yeah, so uh, I think that's it. Uh, heads up, guys. Oh yeah, and sorry, I forgot to mention uh, the review for the case before this one is also involved in the review for this. Eh, uh, sorry, giveaway for this week. Okay, thanks, guys. Cheers.